poster like this one supporting Khalistan movement is a common sight here in Toronto. And now there's another rally which is being organized supporting Khalistan movement on 8th of July. This comes after the assassination of Hardeep Singh Nijjar, a Khalistani leader who was also on the wanted list of NIA. The Khalistani supporters alleged that he was assassinated by Indian agencies and that's the reason they want to organize this rally and gather more strength for this movement. Whereas India alleges that Canada is being too soft on Khalistan movement and terrorism. But for the first time in recent years, uh, Canadian Prime Minister has come out and said that uh, Canada is not soft on terrorism. Rather, they would try and make sure that the Indian diplomats are safe and their interest is protected here in Canada. Now, all eyes are set on 8th of July, how big this rally would be and what would Canada's be response for this rally. And what about the safety of Indian High Commission and the officials working there? That's the big question. And also the divide between Khalistani supporters and Indian supporters is growing here in Canada, so, as is the population here in Canada. So how would it translate into relationships uh, between India and Canada? That's another very important question. Of late, it's been seen that Canada is keen on improving their diplomatic relations with India. In Toronto, Vikram Chaudhary for NDTV.